Welcome, I'm Aliki. I'm here to help you upgrade your energy. What does it mean when you see 1111? This has been seen by so many people in the last decade and just above the last decade. It has a very specific meaning and there's a reason why so many have become aware of 1111 repeatedly popping up in their physical world. And they say, what is it? What am I supposed to do when I see it? How am I supposed to understand what it means? Now, I'm going to talk about the general meaning of 1111, of the number 11, and also of the number one, because all this is important for you to know. But I'm also going to explain how it is you can understand what it means for you. When we see symbols, they are sending us a message, whether it's coming from within us, it's coming from the universe, it's energy flowing forward, trying to tell you something, trying to make you aware of something. And perhaps you don't become aware of it straight away or you don't decipher the message straight away. That doesn't matter. When there's something that you need to see and understand, it will keep repeating. And when you see something repeating, yes, that's when it truly catches your attention. You say, there's something here. There's a reason. I have to understand it. Now, the power of 1111 is a mirroring effect. It is two different things, two different entities repeating and showing themselves next to one another. So it is the number 11 and it is also the number one. It took me so, so long to understand what this meant. What I have come to realize is that, is that it is very, very spiritual. It has a very powerful spiritual meaning. It will not appear to someone who has not realized the power from within them, who is not interested in discovering how their energy works and moving into something higher, something more expansive. They realize you realize, if you're watching this video, it means that you've seen 1111. You realize that there's something more to you. There's some power flowing within you. And this is when it starts to appear to you. That's why many, many people talk about 1111 being a number of ascension. Ascension generally means that you ascend to a higher energy level. You become more expansive, more high frequency, more high vibrational. When you see this number pop up, it's very important that you look within. See within what it is that you need to see. It's not going to be the same for any two of you. Each and every one of you has something within you that is truly powerful. When you see 1111 appear, immediately that day, look within you. Take a moment. It only takes a moment, five minutes, where you sit quietly and you feel your energy and you look within. Don't try to see something specific. Allow whatever it is that there is there to pop up. Trust what comes up in your imagination. Trust what feelings come up, what images come up, the colors you see, the memories you see, and allow them to show you. Allow them to reveal something to you. And the next step, once you see what's revealed from within you, is looking at how it is in your physical reality, in the world around you, you can bring this into fruition. You can see what it is you can do about it. Look at the people that are part of your life. Look at the events happening. 1111 doesn't have to do so much with objects. Actually, I really don't think it has to do with objects at all. It has to do with energy. It has to do with your energy and with the one that you are one with. We could call it twin flames. We could call it divine union. There is someone who you are truly one with. 
And that doesn't mean that as soon as you see 1111, you have to go out on this quest and find the one and convince them that they're one. I've tried to do that. It doesn't work well. No, no. That's not the way to go. The way is to see and find the power within you. Believe in the power of one. There's so much information out there on 1111, on so many different meanings that it could have. And Perhaps most of these are true, but I'm going to stick to talking about the power of one. Now, one, it's one, 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 one. Each is one. Each is whole and complete. It has it all. There's nothing missing. See that. Now, why is it four times one? Because in each world, let's say, the spiritual world, the energy world, and the world, the physical world here. These two are side by side, but there is something between. Let's call it a gateway, let's call it an energy passage, whatever you want to imagine it as. There is something between these two worlds, your energy and your physical world, your energy body and your physical body. And notice how in each, two are one together, but each is also one on its own. And in the other world, again. Now, it is a coming together of these worlds. When you see one, 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 one repeating itself in your physical world, go on a quest within, but don't get lost within you. Don't get lost in the energy within you. Bring that forward here into the physical. See the energy within you and bring it here, in the here and now, because this is where you are. Many say that this is all an illusion. It is not real, that time is an illusion, that the physical world is an illusion. It may be, but you are consciously aware of yourself being here. So see the energy within you, know and understand the energy within you, allow it to take you on that quest, on that journey, on that inner knowing, but bring it here into the physical and see where it takes you. This could take years and years, it could take less, it could take longer, I don't know. But see where it takes you and see how that phys spiritual energy can come forward full force into the physical. The beauty within you, the knowledge within you, your love. It's 1111 is definitely about love. It is about discovering and moving fully into the love of who you are and to all that you are, discovering the divine partner with who you are one with, you always have been one with, and bringing that full force forward into your physical reality, into the here and now. So it is about bringing that which is beyond time and space, which is fully expansive, forever flowing, forever creating, eternal, coming forward into the here and now. Imagine the power, imagine the beauty. When you see 1111, look within, understand it, see it, know it, and allow it to take you into the physical world and see what it is you need to do here. It very often requires a cleaning, a clearing out, a clearing out more of who is in your life, who you are in the physical world. What is it that you are expressing? Notice that there are many parts of you. There's the you that is full of love, full of inspiration, full of happiness. There's the you who feels hurt, perhaps angry, perhaps there's guilt within you. Work through these and allow anything that needs to go to go and move more into the power 
of all that you are, the power of one. You choose who you are. You choose what you bring forward. I hope this gives you insight into what 1111 means. I hope this is inspiring. Allow 1111, when it appears to you, to fill you with inspiration, to fill you with excitement. It is you ascending. It is you moving forward. It is you becoming all that you are. It is a beautiful journey. It is a beautiful symbol, a beautiful message. Very simple, very powerful. I wish you happiness. I wish you love. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe and also remember to like. Thank you so, so much for being here.